And February is Heart Month, and all week long, we're going to be bringing you stories about how to survive a heart attack. Today, we're speaking with two survivors about the symptoms that they experienced and the moments before one of the scariest times of their lives. It was sitting on top of my chest. Sharon Simmons and Diane Gladney lived opposite lives before their heart attacks. I was a smoker, and I was a few pounds overweight. Um, and uh, probably cholesterol with the eating because, you know, we ate out a lot and stuff like that. Meanwhile, Simmons' family had a history of heart disease. And so I've always been a person who works out at the gym. So she always took steps to combat it. I could not believe those words because, again, I thought um, it was the male side of my family. It could not be uh, me. But several years back, both women found themselves in similar terrifying positions. Clearly wasn't right. Both women say they thought initially that they were experiencing terrible heartburn. I'm sweating, you know, my arms started hurting, and I knew all the symptoms. Being a, if you if you a smoker, or heavy, know the symptoms. It was just that I could not catch my breath, and still with those heartburns. Simmons and Gladney experienced a tightness or ache in their chests. They thought they had heartburn and they were extremely fatigued. Simmons thinks she survived because of her healthy lifestyle, while Gladney thinks her knowledge of her symptoms and quick response made the difference. Now they're happy to speak out about their experiences. Simmons has even written a book, all in hopes of saving more lives. You just be aware of what the symptoms are in case something like that should happen. Now, Simmons' book about her experiences is called Through the Storms and Out. All proceeds from the sales go to patient care at Kirkland over at UAB. A very worthwhile cause. We're going to be bringing you special reports all week long, and tomorrow it's going to be all about knowing the signs. We've got advice that you need to hear from a local doctor. Yeah, and local doctors will join us in our studios to answer your questions about a heart attack. If you have a question you would like answered, just email us at reported at WIAT.com. We'll have more on the two ladies featured in today's report coming up at 7 on Facebook Live. And that's where we really get into how different their stories were, Lee, because these women really did have two very different stories. Absolutely. One with a family history, another that knew all of the symptoms, mm -hmm. but also knew that based on some lifestyle choices, she might be more at risk. So we'll talk a little bit more about that. 7 o'clock, Facebook Live. Next on the CBS 42 Morning News, your morning rust. The stories you need to know about before you step out the door. Let's get a check, though, on our way to break on your weather and traffic together with Ashley.